Hello and welcome to this week's um, show on Thursday and um, so as as per usual we have God with us um, today. Um, he's been coming through quite a lot uh, but traditionally we have been having the saints, the angels and Mother Mary and Jesus and all sorts of people um, but for some reason, um, we are with God uh, most of the time now, which actually I quite like. <laughs> um, um, anyway, um, if you are interested in watching any of these videos or want to see more, don't forget to subscribe and press the bell um, because then that way um, you can always be notified. And I don't always post, you know, if you're seeing it on a Facebook or Instagram, I'm not always posting it on that site. So so um, do, do subscribe on YouTube. Anyway, so um, without further ado, let's let's speak to to God um, because He's standing here waiting for to, to speak, and He is saying to me that He is um, He is very warmed by man, uh, warmed in His heart, um, and He says that um, when He thinks of man and when He looks at man. Um, he is rather proud of all that man has achieved and and he feels really sort of excited about about some of the inventions some of the creations that man has made some of the um, the way that they have struggled through adversities and come out the other end and and being more positive and and, and better people and how um, man is more um, adept at, at helping Helping one another than than standing aside and belittling each other, and he he wants to go so far as to say that man is his greatest creation, is his is his most favourite creation, and and the creation that he has had to spend the most time and the most thought and the most energy on. Um, but he says it's all worth it, all well worth it, um, because man, um, he feels, is incredible. And as, as man goes through to the next stage of life and the next new era of life, he feels that man will only excel even more. And um, he's rather excited to see how man, man sort of really um, takes up the baton and takes up the challenge of, of being um, being better, better people. Um, now, he also wants to say that um, many years ago when he was in the beginnings of, of heaven and in the beginnings of, of constructing the, the planet and, and making the animals and the plants and the seas, um, he says to me that um, he never in his wildest dreams thought that he could actually make man in the way that he has. Um, and he says that it's taken so long to reach this stage that he feels that he wants to assure man that he is really, really committed in every way um, and will never ever let man down. And he wants to show a sort of a mark of respect to man and show man that that he is he is true and and his word is true and he says that he um he, he feels the only way to do this is to um, bring about um, more light and more energy to your planet and he says that in time you are going to see um, a lot of um, a lot of light and a lot of energy around you um, and you will feel it rather than see it you will you will feel that your vibration is different you will understand that your um, that things seem a bit more optimistic and and you will start to feel more happier in your lives um, and he says this is this is what he what he feels is that man is ready for that that he should be able to sort of lift your spirits and lift your energy and lift your um the way you view view life on a day-to-day -day basis 
um, because he says that the ways of the old need to be changed and the ways of the old are done with. Man has succeeded everything that they need to achieve from the ways of the old and he says that this is why um, this is going to be the beginning of the new era with this, with this new energy that is placed around us. Um, but it is also, um, he feels, is, is, is showing man that he is real, showing man that, that, that he is true in what he says and that his word is, is, is certainly honest. He said that when, um, in the beginning when he was thinking about changing um, life from this, into this new era, he said that he had um, a lot of sort of um, thoughts about um, are is man ready or or are is this the right time or um, shall I shall I um, shall I delay it a little bit further? But he soon reached the decision that no, this is the time. This is the time to to bring about change, and it will be one thing after another that you will witness how how your world will change. Um, he has also instructed the angelic realm, and the angelic realm will be um, placing this this energy on on the planet. And um, he he has he speaks. He's, he's talking about Archangel Michael and how he has been speaking to him at great lengths about how he wants this energy place and how and how there will be more people that will have more energy and some will have slightly less. But with everyone, they will have this energy. And he's he's saying to me that um, this is the only way forward um, to 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 make man into the superior beings that he wishes for man. Um, and as he as he goes through this these stages of evolvement and stages of where where man is is becoming different um, because of the gifts that he is giving to man. He feels that um, there will be some changes, not only in his thinking, but also in in all of man's thinking, and and he hopes that man will look to the past and and see um, that the, the man of before and think how primitive and how uh, how we need to change, how we are glad that we have changed, and how how we are. Um, grateful to God for, for all that he has, has achieved. And this is his wish. And he draws my hands together and bows my head. My wish is of the greatest, greatest importance, that all of man becomes at one in the idea that change must happen, that change is inevitable, and that change is is part of the process of life. He wishes that man can enjoy the changes that he gives to man. The life force of energy and the, and the, and the goodness that he brings to your world, he feels will make a wonderful change. And he hopes that all of man is grateful for this so that they can indeed walk forward in a better way in their lives and, in, and with optimism for the future. He's thanking you for listening and he's bowing my head again. And he says, and so, so yes, he's, he's finished now. And, and, and so I'm speaking. And what I find incredible about that is um, how his, Precision of timing is so important to God, where he he feels that um, he has chosen his time, uh, where he feels that that man has reached their optimum under the old ways, and 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 to go to the new ways he has to make some changes, um, but he feels that that point is now and that and, and we're ready. So um, yes, we are all ready to change um, and and have that lovely warm energy. Thank you very much. Um, but thank you for listening and um, see you on Sunday. Okay, goodbye.